Understanding the phrase, in bed with, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone, welcome to today's English language learning video. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, in bed with. This is a phrase you might come across in movies, books, or even in daily conversations. It's a bit tricky but very interesting. So, let's dive in and understand what it really means. Initially, let's look at the literal meaning. The phrase, in bed with, literally refers to the physical act of being in a bed with someone or something. For example, the cat is in bed with its owner. Here, it simply means sharing the bed space. Now, let's explore the more complex and idiomatic usage of, in bed with. Figuratively, this phrase is used to describe a situation where two parties, often unexpectedly, are collaborating or forming an alliance. It usually implies a level of secrecy or controversy. For example, the politician was in bed with the media. This doesn't mean they are literally sharing a bed, but rather they are working closely, often with a hint of underhand dealings or unethical collaboration. To understand it better, let's look at some contextual examples. 1. Business. The new startup is in bed with a major tech company. This suggests a close and potentially secretive partnership. 2. Politics. The government is in bed with lobbyists. Here, it implies possibly corrupt or secretive dealings. 3. Personal relationships. While less common, it can also be used in personal contexts to imply an unusual or morally questionable alliance. A word of caution. Because of its suggestive nature, it's important to use this phrase carefully. It's often used in a critical or accusatory manner, so understanding the context is key to avoid misunderstandings. And that's a wrap on, in bed with. Remember, while it can be taken literally, it's often used to describe a figurative partnership that might have some hidden implications. We hope this video has shed some light on this interesting phrase. Thanks for watching, and keep practicing your English. See you in the next video.